Hey guys, Chris again, ClassicVWBugs.com, and in this short video, I want to talk to you about outstanding wheels and tires. Guys, uh, I don't know what it is lately, but I got a, a lot of questions lately on the white wall tires that we use, the beauty trim rings, hubcaps, just wheel and tire dressing to begin with. Uh, so I'm going to go over that quickly with you, where I get my stuff and uh, what we use predominantly here to give us our signature uh, look that we have on our Beetle. So tires. Uh, these are the Coker Nostalgia Radial Classic White Wall Tires. Two and a quarter inch, I believe, is the size of the White Wall. And you can get these tires in the 165 R15 size from either Jegs or SummitRacing.com. Check either one of those because uh, sometimes one or the other has them in stock and the other one doesn't. So you are looking at probably 230 a tire. $230. So uh, pretty pretty steep nowadays. Uh, they used to be like 160 bucks a piece for the longest time. So I am outside. I am sorry if you hear car noise in the back. Uh, but uh, beauty trim rings, I get those from eBay. So put in a CCI beauty trim ring, 15 inch beauty trim ring. That's an inch and three quarter trim ring. And that's basically for any sort of classic car uh, that you can, uh, or any wheel that you can put this on for any type of car really um, and they work really well they're actually plastic guys they are not stainless steel I bought the stainless steel before in the past and the stainless steel are not as shiny and not as easy to go on and don't fit as nice as these and um, you know for about 60 or 70 dollars you can get a set of four and you have the beauty trimming I like doing that because then I don't have to paint the rim uh, two-tone you know my painters hate doing these rims in two-tone color so I usually put the beauty trimming and that then bypasses you doing a two-tone rim hubcaps are these actually are the stainless steel hubcaps that I got from CIP1.com they're about 60 bucks a piece um, if you go with German which I like as well. I either go either or, whichever is in stock at the time. Uh, so the Germans were not in stock at the time, so I picked up the stainless steel. And the stainless steel hubcaps are pretty much um, around $60 a piece. And the German hubcaps uh, from CIP1 or Wolfsburg West are going to be at least $100 a piece. Now, jbugs.com actually has the German hubcap for $60 bucks a piece. So the same as the stainless steel here. Uh, but they're both very nice. I mean, the stainless steel might have just a slight uh, polished look to it or like a brushed look to it, but it is a heavy-duty uh, hubcap. It's got good weight to it. So, um, yeah, really, really cool. And that's that's basically what we do for all of our cars. Sometimes we do bias ply tires. And, again, you're going to want to go with the 560R15. So bias ply tires. I actually put a bias in my trunk here so let me show you that in a second so there's your standard 560 uh, 15 tire bias ply uh, I get the bias for the trunk because usually the 165 R15 radial tire will not fit in the tub here unless you let air out so um, I just go with the bias it shows really well looks really nice that's more like a three inch white wall or a two and three quarter inch white wall so yeah, that's basically what we do, and that's how you dress up your tires, guys. Uh, I do not paint my rims anymore on my own. I used to in the beginning with the Rust-Oleum paint, but now I just, you know, what we do for a better look, I send them to my painter, and they media blast the rims down to bare metal, and then they'll paint them with some uh, pro paint there instead of using a rattle cam. It just lasts a little bit longer, of course, and it has a nice gloss to it and gives a nice finished look. So... Generally speaking, guys, that is what we do for our tires. Jegs and Summit Racing to get your tires. CCI Beauty Trim Ring, a 15-inch off of eBay. And my hubcaps are either from JBug, CIP1.com, depending on what's in stock, German or uh, stainless steel. And at the time, this is the time of this video. This is what the pricing is. They have been going up. Everything's going up in price with this inflation going on. So at the time of July 2022, these are the prices. So, hope you enjoyed that video. Please be sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and be bringing you VW content like this each and every week. See ya.